The Bloodline has arrived. The longest reigning tag champions in WWE history, the Usos. The longest reigning Universal Champion in WWE history, Roman Reigns and their special counsel, Paul Heyman. A group that has stood atop the WWE for the last few years with the dominance, the swagger, and the gold to prove it. And tonight, what they do will prove it even further. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman A decade ago, Roman Reigns set foot in WWE alongside two men, and they changed the world. I dare say the bloodline is even more dominant than that group. When you look at the titles and the main events that Reigns and the Usos have won, it's hard to argue. The Usos, the most dominant team of this generation. The Tribal Chief, the most dominant main event competitor in decades. The Bloodline simply cannot be stopped. It is their table, their company, their industry. Here comes the head of the table, the Tribal Chief. Roman Reigns, the leader of the Bloodline, has arrived. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. Well, here is the merciless leader of the Bloodline. Yeah, you can make the argument that the Bloodline is perhaps the most dominant group in the history of WWE. I think you're right, Saxton. Roman put his entire family on his back and has since pushed them all to incredible heights. He's achieved things that most only dream of. Just piles of championships. He made the long climb up the mountain and shoved everybody else off of it. Main event, and his opponent, representing the Usos from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions, main event, Jay Uso. What a lineage 
part of an all-time great dynasty. Yeah, but Jey Uso reached new heights in his career alongside the bloodline. He may primarily be a tag team competitor, but in singles action, Jey Uso is as big a threat as anybody on the roster. And for Roman Reigns, this is about pride and dominance. It's about Roman Reigns, this is about pride and dominance. It's about asserting his role as the provider and the head of the table for the NOIE family, and that includes his cousin, Jey Uso. In his own twisted way, Roman is showing his love for Jey Uso. He believes he's the only one who can provide for his family. He truly thinks that if he loses this match, his value decreases and the family is worse off. I'm glad my family reunions aren't like this. Samoan drop. Jey Uso with a tall task tonight, mentally and physically, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I don't envy Jey's position, but anybody writing him off as the inferior athlete is just fooling themselves. Jey Uso has heart and speed. He's got to settle in for the long run and commit to taking Roman down one piece at a time. Oh, God! That was an absolutely haphazard, uncalculated risk. And I have no doubt they're going to pay dearly for it. Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. The floor, the barricades, our table. None of these things are fun to collide with. Reigns is trying to pick his opponent apart physically and mentally. Ooh. And Jay saw it coming. is to mount more punishment. Yeah. Roman drop kick. Pluto. Uh oh. Close line. Avoided contact and brought a big attack of their own. Taking it outside the ring now. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. He climbs into the ring. Double in shot. Guys, we could be looking at the start of one of the old-time great sports entertainment rivalries. Way to put the cart before the horse, bro. Sure, there's potential here. There always is, but they're not exactly having to be ripped apart from each other yet. This much in them at this point. Oh, knee right through the stomach. Punch connects. And just like that, he said, crashing to the floor. to be mindful of the referee's count here. And this has been as physical a matchup as ooh, we expected. Both these men doing whatever it... Well, yeah, like well, running away, Byron. Well, that's a cowardly move. And he's not going to get very far. Oh, oh. Cowardly or was it brilliant, oh, Saxton? Lord. What a sucker. Big punch finds its mark. Oh, I hope they back up. They're, they're getting too close for Cup. Uh-oh, this is going to be bad. Really bad. A oh, slap. Brought back into the ring from the floor. End.
Jey Uso goes for a quick ride. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man, look at his eyes. This isn't going to be good. He's got nasty plans in mind. Uh-oh. I'm in shock. What a disaster. And he slides him back to the mat. Right into the corner. Superman punch by the tribal chief. And that was an effective attack, guys. Wow, Reigns nailed it. That's it, and Roman Reigns has done it. Here is your winner, Roman Reigns. I don't see how you can't be disappointed in winning like this. And how can you even celebrate a win as tainted as this one? Tainted? How? Oh, come on. You saw the blatant cheap shot, Corey. All I saw was the drive to win at any cost, which they just did, mind you. And to that, I say kudos.